So the last time I came to Disneyland was Sunday, October 28th to film that churro video that I released on Halloween. Link in the description below if you want to see it. And as I was roaming around Disneyland in October, like I said, I was noticing a lot of Christmas stuff was kind of already up, even though the Halloween celebration was still going on. So today is Friday, November the 2nd, and I want to check out if they have a blend of both holidays and how much Christmas stuff is already up. And just for a point of reference, the Halloween time was supposed to end October 31st, which was this past Wednesday. And the holiday celebration is supposed to start next Friday, November 9th. So as you can see behind me at the entrance, we still have the pumpkin patches of Mickey, Pluto, Donald, and all the gang. And the same could be said here for DCA as Oogie Boogie is still casting its spell over here at DCA's entrance. So now let's actually enter and see what's different, if anything. So here on Main Street, for the most part, it seems like everything Halloween related is gone, including the big smiling and winky Mickey pumpkin that was in the middle, which will be replaced by a humongous Christmas tree. And we do have the entrance part of Main Street with some Christmas decorations already. While if you go down actual Main Street, uh, there will be no decorations yet. So here at the hub around the Walt Disney and Mickey statue, there are no longer the pumpkins that represent the different lands here at Disneyland. And if you notice behind me, the Sleeping Beauty castle is already with snow on it. I don't know exactly when they put it, but Sunday when I was here, if you look at the churro video, it already had some snow on it. This castle is especially beautiful. It's beautiful now, but it's more beautiful at the nighttime, which just like I did for the Halloween time, a daytime and nighttime video, I'll be definitely doing that for the Christmas time celebration. So currently, the It's a Small World is closed as they prepare for It's a Small World holiday. But you can kind of see on the outside, they are starting to prepare and they do have some features of Christmas. And as you can see, we could even have some of the holiday merchandise merchandise already out here. So as the stormtroopers behind me start arresting people, I just wanted to quickly show that the ghost who haunted Space Mountain is now gone. So now we get a regular Space Mountain. You can't really tell here during the daytime. And I don't even know if they probably light it up during the nighttime. But the only symbol here at Disneyland that is still Halloween related is here on Frontierland. And that is the Halloween tree. And then of course we have the ride that is in both Halloween time and holiday celebration and it is a haunted mansion holiday so outside of Pooh's corner as you can see they do have some holiday decorations but on the inside they still have those halloween treats crater country wasn't decorated for the halloween time but with the look of Pooh's corner and splash mountain it does look like they are doing it for the holiday celebration so that's it here from disneyland so you know what time that means it means it's now time to come over to dca check it out so just like disneyland here during in buena vista street there is no sign of anything halloween related but unlike disneyland there is no sign of anything christmas here already and then as you can see behind me there is no longer the headless horseman here and there is no longer any bats coming out of this building behind me but honestly i think what i'm gonna miss most about the halloween time was all the purple surrounding this tree and this water fountain it just made it so spectacular in my opinion i really hope they do something here for the holidays because i've never been here for the holidays so it'll be cool to see this all lit up like it was during the halloween time so it appears as the entrance to cars land they have now turned it just a regular cars land and there's no longer the curse for halloween time but next to cars land like literally right next to it there are these carts with a couple of Christmas merchandise. As I went from one end to the other end of Cars Land, there appears to be no signs of there ever being a Halloween time here. And at the current moment, unlike Disneyland, there are zero signs that this will even be a holiday celebration. Okay, I lied. There is just one small hint that there was a Halloween celebration here. And the only thing left here from the Halloween time are these cars Halloween movie posters. So I guess as far as DCA is concerned, it's mostly all Halloween doubt except for those movie posters. And there's literally no sign of Christmas 
except for the merchandise. So guys, that'll be it for today's video. If you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button. That way you guys don't miss when we explore the holidays edition for both Disneyland and DCA. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop that like and share it. And of course, I hope to see you all in the next one.